so hey guys we're back with our starkling skyro answer so we've learned intro variables primitive and we are on operation so operations one integer types implement basic comparison and arithmetic operators the felt 252 we've talked about this a while ago felt 252 it was here 252 here it's the fundamental type for creating all types in the core library this is the integer types highly recommended instead of the felt 252 mm, it's here so felt 252 operations should be avoided where possible as they could have unwanted behavior so get let's get hint you can check the list of operators here appendix 02 and symbols so it says here operator so let's check this out so this is the operators arithmetic multiplication and assignment okay so in here return the solution of x time to the power of 3 plus y minus 2 so this is f n poly u size u size u size fill me do not change so this will we need to fill this one so we need to use maybe we need to return the value of this so for multiplication um hmm. multiplication exponent so we need to use this one um let rest it um rest is equals to this so equals x times x times x plus y minus two because we need to multiply x three times here minus two and semicolon so that we need to um check it for the next one so let's test this one okay compiled perfectly and we are ready to proceed for our next tutorial operations 2 so cairo has native integers type we have u8 u3 this is what we check it this one this is the integer type we will use integer type instead of felt 252 whenever possible here because the integer type comes with added security features and provide extra pro protection against vulnerabilities that's why they are using that so use size which support more operators than felt and always watch out for overflows example in the last let's try to use them overflows this overloadable overflows so let's try to get some hints use percent for modulus this one for division and this one for multiplication okay <laughs> we need to use this one modulus modulus maybe we can modulus spelling of modulus here m only okay anyways we need to calculate the modulus of x and y so let rest equals to um x and y that one semicolon then this one we need to calculate floor division so it's division here so let rest equals x 
divide the division y and this one multiplication uh, let let rest equals x times y so maybe that's it okay and that's it for operations tune in for the next one as we will be doing the if do you enjoy this video and you feel that you finally found a high quality web3 channel on youtube check out my other free educational content and subscribe for a new video every week